Now keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. All right, well, now that we've made it through most of the morning, <laughs> we're done with the coldest stuff, right? Uh, the coldest of the air is behind us. Uh, it's really going to be the big weather story of the day as well. We saw teens area rot wide this morning. Tulsa dipped down to 18 degrees. It was 13 in Bristow, as I mentioned at the top of the newscast. Bartlesville down to 12. McAllister 16. Check out your hometown telling you what you already know. It was super cold outside. By the way, not record setting cold. Four is the record for this day in history, but well below normal. Definitely unseasonably cool. And our typical high this time of the year is 51 degrees. We're going to land well below that today. But on the flip side of things, we'll be a little bit warmer than we were yesterday and also the day before that. And the sunshine's nice to see today as well. Yesterday, we got stuck in the cloud cover for many of us throughout the day. Today, Viper 2 HD scanning dry all across the state of Oklahoma. Not expecting any rain for the next couple of days. Really, the main weather maker, and this is the same system, by the way, that dumps snow into Texas, but getting kind of messy from Atlanta through the Carolinas, up towards Washington, D.C., all the way up towards Boston. So watching this storm system, but obviously that one's moving away from us. Our next weather maker is a cool front that's up to our north. You can notice a little bit of snow breaking out on the back side of this front. This front will be arriving Thursday night into Friday. It will bring another shot of cold air, but I don't think we're going to see much in the way of snow or rain with it. There could be a flurry, but most likely we'll just see a few clouds in our skies and that cold weather for Friday. Today, though, sunshine has returned. Bartlesville, Manford, McAllister, also Muskogee through our neighborhood network. Yeah, that's the case in Tulsa, too. Downtown cam looks pretty good. I understand there was a little bit of ice even reported this morning on the river. Sun's hitting it. That's gone now. It's 33 degrees through our Brookside cam. Feels like 28, though. We have a variable wind at 6 miles per hour. We'll see a southwest wind as we head into this afternoon. We'll say at about 10 to 15. We're at 35 now in Bartlesville. Quite a recovery. That dry air it really uh, drops off quickly, but it also heats up pretty nicely. 33 currently in Muskogee. It's 33 in McAllister. And again, when you factor in the wind, yeah, you're going to need the big coat as you head out today. And of course, don't forget the sunglasses with all that sunshine out there. Here's Futurecast, though. Otherwise, things are quiet. Notice the wind arrows out of the south and west. Overnight tonight, temperatures will dip mainly into the 20s. There'll be a few teens when you join us tomorrow morning, but it won't be quite as cold tomorrow morning. And we'll be tracking our cold front tomorrow again. For most of the day, it stays well to our north. So temperatures will likely land in the upper 40s for many of us. Might see a few more clouds on Thursday. And then this front starts to arrive Thursday evening into early Friday morning. Some clouds around and again the return of north winds and that cooler air. But that air will be short lived because we'll see a nicer warm up for the weekend. So today 41 in Coffeyville, 42 in Pryor, mid 40s, Old Mulgee to McAllister. Overnight we'll drop to 17 in Bartlesville, 22 degrees in Pryor by morning, 23 in McAllister and Tulsa, 24 to start your day tomorrow. A very light south breeze uh, for tomorrow morning. 48 will be our high on Thursday. Again, back to the 30s on Friday. Some clouds around. Could there be a flurry? Sure, but the rain chance and the snow chance, less than 20%. We're back to the mid-40s for Saturday, so the weather looks good Saturday afternoon for the Jingle Bell Run. New time, new location mm -hmm. this year, downtown. 50 on Sunday, 51 on Monday. Our next storm system may be arriving by next Tuesday or Wednesday. Right now it's a 20% chance. And speaking of Saturday, good to see a more calm Saturday. The last few yeah, have been no kind kidding. of crazy. I know, the wind, right? <laughs> yes. It seems like every single uh -huh. Saturday for the past several months that wind has gotten us. Right now, <laughs> the wind doesn't look that bad. Good. Good deal. Thank you, Julie.